Hello and welcome to RGIT Australia's training video on RTO Manager's Agent Portal. This short step-by-step -step video aims to educate our valued agent partners with the latest updates made to RTO Manager's Agent Portal. As you know, RGIT Australia application process is online. This online process aims to facilitate the submission of prospective students, expression of interest, and associated documentation and accelerate the student selection and admission process for all parties. The agents can fill up the prospective student's online application form by logging in to RGIT's RTO manager. The login credentials will be provided to the prospective agents by RGIT Australia. Agents can go to RGIT's official webpage and to RTO manager link as shown here. Once signed into RTO Manager, Agents now has an access to proceed further to student online application at RGIT Australia. Once the agent logs in with the given credentials by RGIT Australia, the agent will have an access to RGIT RTO Manager portal, where agents have to go to new apply link as shown here and proceed further to student online application form by pressing start a new online application link and the applicants need to view and agree to terms and conditions to proceed further. Hence being specific, the terms and conditions should be viewed and agreed by the prospective students. However, in step 5 of the student online application, they can further view the terms and conditions after downloading the application summary form. As there are five steps of completing the student online application form, the first step looks like this, where the prospective students have to fill up the personal details such as the name, date of birth, mail ID, country of residence, nationality, passport number, visa number, and such. Regarding the USI number, if you have a USI number, you can enter your USI number and those who don't have the USI number however, can proceed further without the USI number as of for now. Then moving further down, students have to fill up their current address like their country of residence, their flat details, their street number, their street name, their state, postcode, their phone number and such. Once you are done completing step 1, you can move to next page for step 2. Moving further to Student Online Application Step 2, the students have to fill up the details regarding to their language and cultural diversity, their schooling and current employment. Students should also be specific about the early course details as it's required. Once the students are done completing Step 2, then you can move to next page as indicated here. Moving further to Student Online Application Step 3, the prospective students have to fill up the enrollment details regarding the campus, intake year, course selection, preferred start date, course duration, enrollment fee, and such. Once the student completes filling the required information, students now have to add the specific course by pressing the Add New Course link. After completion of all the required details, you can now go to next or if certain changes are to be made, you can go back and make the required changes. Moving further to student online application step 4, the prospective students have to fill the additional information as required and then guardian contact. Once the student is done with Step 4 online application form, then you can go to Next as indicated here. Or if changes are to be made, you can go back and edit the changes as required. Once the Step 4 is completed, the applicants will receive an application preview where you can view the login details and enrollment details. Then the applicants need to confirm by clicking the confirm link to proceed further to student online application step 5. 
Moving further to Student Online Application Step 5, the prospective students should simply upload the certified documents for the approval. The maximum upload is 5 MB. Please ensure that your files, especially your photo and copy of passport are resized before uploading. It is mandatory to upload all the compulsory files. Students now have to download the application summary form by pressing download application link. Application summary is the EOI, expression of interest form is one of the transaction documents to ensure students' expression of interest to study at RGIT Australia. Once the EOI is completed, it has to be signed and uploaded by the applicant along with the other relevant certified documents such as passport bio page, academic documents, signed application form, other relevant certified documents and IELTS results or ELICO certificate. Once all these certified documents are uploaded, students can now go to submit application link. Students and agents will further receive the acknowledgement email with the links to RGIT policies, handbook, and prospectus. Students and agents might receive further emails if any additional documents are required by RGIT Australia. Please feel free to contact one of RGIT sales and marketing staff for any further queries. Thank you for watching the video.